like the whole world's economy is based on some very rich people getting much richer and all the poor people paying for that and the middle class paying for that. And it's time that we change this. We, it's also time that we changed out of this money-based driven stuff into gifting, into gifts, like into not bartering. I'm saying go even further than that. Go into gifting our time, our energy, our resources and everything to each other and show appreciation for that and show love. So I want to change the world in a lot of ways. <laughs> Whether I get the opportunity or not is a different matter. But, the, uh, but, but all of these problems are actually created by the fact that they're all based on unloving premises anyway. The entire world's economy is unloving. Well, you can just see, right? There's, there was a really good picture. That man, that artist, what was his name? There's an artist on the net called David Dees. One of, one of you sent me an email about this. And uh, on, on, the web, on his website, he's got all this art. I don't agree with all of it, but there's one picture that he has of a, a person standing on the map of Africa, a child, uh, actually crouching on the map of Africa, totally emancipated physically, emaciated, sorry, physically, and, and, and in this terrible state. And there's a background picture of all the fat people in the USA. Right? That he, he's commenting about the obesity in the USA. But, you know, how does that happen? How does it happen that, the, that there's a large proportion of the population in the Western world that's overweight? I think even in here in Australia, we have become now the, the second country in terms of overweight in the entire, per population in the, in the world. What does that tell us about what we're doing? Well, besides telling us that there's quite a few emotions we need to work through, it also is telling us that there's quite a few emotions we need to work through in terms of giving this beautiful country's produce to other countries who don't have it. Now, you know, there has been historically in Australia where they've had bumper crops of wheat and burnt the wheat <coughs> rather than sell it because it would reduce the price on the world market. Right. Now, how do we let that happen? There's something in us that we need to heal there, isn't there? And it's to do with money. It's to do with the lack of abundance, the worry about abundance. Right? So, so let us deal with those issues, emotionally deal with those issues. When we're not treating the world in a way that's loving, look at the emotions within you that cause you to death. And you will find in many cases that it's related to the lack of abundance that you feel you have in your own life. So that's related to an emotion in your childhood about abundance. Deal with those emotions. It's really important to deal with those emotions for the world.